What'd you say? I can't hear you. Come here. What I can bomb this when I kick it. That's it. Is that a bomb? I, I can kick it like high. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm more at home still. <laughs> what do like, I need to do if they're new to this channel? Like, subscribe, and ring that notification bell. That's right. Why? So you don't miss any episodes of our videos. Tell them what we're going to do today. We are going to fix the hay ring, and we're going to tell you a little bit about Sissy's party. Oh, we are? Yeah. Okay. I didn't know about that last part, but apparently we're going to tell you a little bit about Sissy's party that we're going to have later. But first, we got to fix that hay ring because we put hay in there, and then what do the goats do? They broke it. They climb inside of it, then what do they do? They poop and pee and all kinds of stuff all over that hay and it goes to waste, doesn't it? So, what are we going to do? How are we going to fix it? Do you know? No. Nah. No? Okay, well, I'm going to tell you what we're going to do. Alright, come here. I'll tell you what we're going to do. So, what we're going to do, we're going to go in there. We got that roll of field fence that's left over. We're going to roll it around it and uh, wire tie it to the hay ring. Why? Then, we're going to have to get the old... Uh, fencing pliers out and we're going to cut some holes in it that's big enough for them to fit their heads through and not get their horns hung up uh, where they can reach their head in there and eat the hay and not climb through it and get in there and poop and pee all over the hay and ruin it. Yeah. We went through quite a few hay bales last year that just went to waste. I ended up having to drag it out um, just there's poop and pee it's it all gross gone. and stunk. It's all gone already. Yeah. So we got some more hay coming this week. Um, I got a buddy bringing us over um, six or seven bells and I do not want them to go to waste. I want them to last this winter. So this is what we're gonna do. Watch out buddy. So this is what we're gonna do in order to help um, keep the goats out of it, but where they're able to eat it. Hopefully the wind is not too terrible. Today, once we get out there, cause it's blowing pretty hard. We got a storm system moving in tonight. It's supposed to uh, maybe some tornadoes and hail, all that good stuff and what are we having later today? Uh, a birthday party. Who who we have? Squat down here. Who are we having a birthday party for? Me. So your birthday's tomorrow, right? Yeah. And you're gonna be nine. Six. No, nine. 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 It's she's she's six. been four. Four? No, no, it's nine. She's so, not having a birthday, remember? So we're having a kind of a family get together tonight for. Remember, she's not having a birthday. Yeah, for Holly's birthday. And then we'll have an actual party with her and some friends here later, right? When football season's over. When football season's over. But tonight, um, in-laws are coming over, grandparents, um, her aunt and uncle, all that stuff. And we're just going to hang out, eat some good food. and chili. Some chili. And hopefully chili. the storm system holds off a little longer. Ow! Like, ah. it, like every party, like my birthday party... It was stormy, now it's going to be stormy Sissy's birthday party. Yeah, so without further ado, we're going to go ahead and get started so we can get this done before everyone gets here. What do you think? Yeah. First thing, we're going to have to get Snowflake out of that hay ring. <laughs> Easy. <laughs> Alright guys, well I'm going to head in the shop, get some tools, and we will meet you guys in the goat pen. Well, that's one way to get them out. Yeah. Alright, so you can see this hay ring here. Then will they climb in and out? We're just going to wrap this field fence around it here. And then cut some holes in different slots. Uh, not every single hole, but at least four or five holes where they can spread out, get their heads in there, and, and eat some food. What do you think? Yeah. Hay, not food. That's hay is, food. Hay is food. Yeah, but it's like snack. Ew, don't MJ, pee. don't pee right here. I'm trying to work. What's wrong with you, girl? Huh? You can see her head's been getting stuck a lot in the fence. You can't tell? Yeah, look at her horns. Mm -hmm. Silly goose. You're skinny. I don't want to hold this. Alright, we're about to get started. 
sure when I clip all this stuff that you pick it help pick it up off the ground okay got it I, uh, this isn't going to work. Why? I'm saying for them. I mean, they're they're going to uh, hop in when you're doing it. Here, Hunter. No, no, hold it out. They'll get out. It's all right. Sure. Yep. They're out. Guys, still with me? You're not focusing very good. All right, so you can kind of see maybe what I'm going after now. Um, I got to tie it in. I'll tie it back into this right here. And then I'll go through and 
um, wire tie it to some of those angled pieces in there and then I'll cut some holes and different gaps and stuff like that so we are just about done saying that we don't show up to play they can beat us All right, finally got it all buttoned down. Now I've got to go around with some bailing wire and uh, tighten down some few spots on each one and then trim some holes. Hopefully this wind isn't too bad. It's pretty breezy out here today, but um, hopefully I don't have to put music over all this because of the wind. So hopefully this road mic does its job. Alrighty, now we got it secured pretty well all the way around. I'm going to cut like a, a block out of this right here and uh, just kind of see how it looks. Hopefully it'll be sufficient for them to get their heads in and where their bodies can't get through it. Uh, I just pulled this. So I'm going to cut this one. I'm going to cut this one right here. So that I can wrap it around and tie it to this, and then I'll cut this one right here. So I'll have about a. I went like this. I went like this. I did it all tipped and almost fell on me. Don't. Actually, I think I'm gonna do these ones right here. Stop! It's starting to tip. Just see how it, how it looks. So it's probably it's probably hard to pick this up on video um, how big it is but pretty much it's four boxes probably about 14 inches by 14 inches is what it is here um, plenty of room for them to get their heads in and their horns in and out without being able to climb in it and getting the hay all poopy and peeing all over it and all that stuff that they ruined so many bells last year and it just costed money and wasted money and all that stuff. 
that uh, they weren't able to sure eat. Are you sure this is going to work? I'm, I'm pretty confident it's going to work. What do you think? Mm. So, that is all we got on today's video. Nope. Don't you poke me with that thing. If you guys like this video, please smash that like button. If you guys haven't subscribed to Moorhead Homestead, please subscribe and ring that notification bell. You guys got anything? Nope. Nope. If you guys would, drop in the comments I below. I guess what to say. What? Snowflake. Snowflake, right. It does snowflake look like a snowflake. Watch your eyes with those things. All right, guys. Tomorrow is Allie's birthday. By the time you see this, it'll already be past her birthday. But um, yeah. I'd like to thank all you guys that dropped comments below telling her happy birthday. She really appreciates it. She gets kind of nervous when you start talking about her on video. So. Oh, look. I, that's cool. But well, I thank all you guys for tuning in today. Until next time, God bless.